Okay, boys and girls, let's review our Bible verse this week. It is, teach me your way, Lord, and I will live by your truth. Give me an undivided mind to fear your name. Psalm 86, 11. Okay, this week, our Bible story is about the Psalms. We're going to learn about King David and the Psalms. King David, the second king of Israel, was the great grandson of Ruth and Boaz. He loved the Lord with all his heart and expressed his love by writing poems that were later set to music or said as prayers. These special poems were known as Psalms. Many Psalms written by King David are in the book of Psalms in the Bible. In Psalm 23, King David writes a Psalm of comfort. The Lord is my shepherd. I have all that I need. He lets me rest in green meadows. He leads me beside peaceful streams. He renews my strength. He guides me along right paths, bringing honor to his name. Even when I walk through the darkest valley, I will not be afraid, for you are close beside me. Your rod and your staff protect and comfort me. You prepare a feast for me in the presence of my enemies. You honor me by anointing my head with oil. My cup overflows with blessings. Surely your goodness and unfailing love will pursue me all the days of my life, and I will live in the house of the Lord forever. In Psalm 86, King David writes a psalm of prayer. Bend down, O Lord, and hear my prayer. Answer me, for I will need your help. Protect me, for I am devoted to you. Save me, for I serve you and trust you. You are my God. Be merciful to me, O Lord, for I am calling on you constantly. Give me happiness, O Lord, for I give myself to you. O Lord, you are so good, so ready to forgive so full of unfailing love for all who ask you for your help. Listen closely to my prayer, O Lord. Hear my urgent cry. I will call to you whenever I'm in trouble, and you will answer me. No pagan god is like you, O Lord. None can do what you can do. All nations you have made will come and bow before you, Lord, and they will praise your holy name. For you are great and perform wonderful deeds. You alone are God. Teach me your ways, O Lord, that I may live according to your truth. Grant me purity of heart so that I may honor you. With all my heart, I will praise you, O Lord, my God. I will give glory to your name forever, for your love is very great. This week, boys and girls, we're going to be continuing to learn about the Psalms of David because he continued to sing the praises of the Lord. And today, we're going to work in our Bible packet and we're going to be working on Bible workbook page 45. We're going to be doing Bible workbook page 45 in our Bible packet.